Namo Buddhaya. Dear meritorious devotees and my dear children, do we really need a guider or a teacher for our life? Let's learn this from a nice story. One day, there was a kite which was flying up above in the sky. The kite was so happy and also the kite was so proud about him because it had reached into a higher level in the sky. The kite still needed to fly furthermore into the sky. But there was an obstacle for this, and that was the string and the person who was holding it. The kite started complaining to the man. The kite said, I need my freedom. Please give me my freedom. Let go of me. Then the man said, Do not ever think to escape from me. Do not find the freedom in an unnecessary way. Because of me, you have come to such a height. So do not ever try to be free from me. But the kite still wanted to fly up into the sky. So the kite started pulling up to the sky. All of a sudden, the string was broken. And you know what happened when the string is broken in the kite. The kite suddenly crashed down to the earth, destructing itself because of its own ego. This story is so much related to our lives. Dear meritorious devotees and my dear children, our life is like a kite which is flying up above in the sky. We always try to fly high. We always like to be successful in our life. So if we gain the success in our life, when we become more knowledgeable, when we become more intelligent, and when everything is going in the right way, or the correct way in our life, we tend to think that we don't want the advice and instructions from our parents, from our teachers, and from our elders. But if we lose the guidance and the instructions from our elders, teachers, and parents, we will end up in the same place where the kite was we will end up in a huge trouble in our life. Dear devotees and my dear children, we all need the guidance of our parents and our teachers. When we came to this world, we knew nothing. Our parents taught us how to walk. They taught us how to eat. And they taught us how to do the day-to-day -day activities. Our teachers taught us how to speak, how to write, how to learn. Because of them, with the help of them, we are learning so many things in our life. Because of them, we have found the success in our life. So we should always be grateful for them. And don't forget to listen to the guidance and the instructions from your parents and from your teachers. Because even the Supreme Buddha thought, soon after he became enlightened, he thought, living without a teacher, living without the guidance of a teacher is a suffering to the life. So I must find a teacher. But there was no human or a god which had a greater wisdom than our great teacher Supreme Buddha. Finally, Supreme Buddha thought, I must consider this Dhamma, the realization of myself as my teacher. So even the Supreme Buddha had a teacher. So if even the Supreme Buddha had a teacher, there's nothing to talk about us. We all need the guidance of our teachers and our parents. 
when you find the success in your life and when everything is going in the correct way in your life please do not forget to listen to your parents and to your teachers because they have much more greater experience than us though you are knowledgeable and intelligent than your parents it does not mean that you have much more greater life experience than your parents and teachers they surely have the experience than us so do not forget to listen and pay attention to those advice and instructions because we all need teachers we all need the guidance and we all need the help from others so listen to the advice from your parents and from your teachers and obey them and please try to follow those advices if you follow the good advice and instructions from your parents and teachers you will find the success in your life surely namo buddhaya tiruvansaranai